Hey guys, Cheetah here, and today I'm going to have for you uh, two multi input uh, cauldron bud circuit designs. I'm not really sure what else to call them, but yeah, they both work off an interesting concept. Uh, they don't have much difference except one uh, has the cauldron, this one, but it's only 16 blocks. You can see the cauldron. Uh, but this one, you can't see the cauldron, but it's 20 blocks volume. So, yeah. Um, so, this is what they do. They're sort of. They're using that cauldron box uh, concept thing that I showed you a while ago. And, yeah. They're, they're work, they have a lot of different ways you can input into them. But, uh, f so the first ones are the mud. Uh, and redstone and dust and redstone torch. They don't work with block of redstone or just a regular block. But I do work with these two. I don't know of anything else. But the next thing is the lever. As you can see, that works perfectly. And all four types of pressure blades. As you can see, these ones don't work. Uh, neither does that. Or that. And they don't work like this, like this, or anything else. They only work like that. So just throw these out because they're useless. This one's basically the same, it's just with the cauldron up there, which could be useful for some things, you know, so you can signify that you've actually done something, or like an adventure map or something. But uh, yeah, and it just basically works the same. Uh, and yeah, another thing about these design, this design is that it does work on like horizontal surface with the cauldron, with the torch and the inputs, with the pressure plate. Um, uh, redstone as well. And yeah. So I'm not really sure what purpose you might have with this, except it's quite a weird sort of dual hedge monster one, as you can see here. Uh, yeah, it, what I find what I find quite funny about this design is that it doesn't. You can take a dual edge uh, circuitry kind of input into this, but it doesn't take a direct input from a lever. Or it's using the bud. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like it quite a fair bit. And yeah, so I'm not going to do a tutorial for these because they're only one wide. They're not tileable, sadly, but yeah, here's the redstone for the uh, one with the cauldron on top. And only 16. Uh, there's just nothing really hidden. That has to be full of water, obviously. That's a comparator. Uh, yeah. This one, same thing, except this has to be a slab, otherwise this will burn out there. And yeah, but nothing else really. So thank you guys for watching, don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.